Psalm 92. I want to read one verse of scripture, the 10th verse. The psalmist writes these words, I shall be anointed with fresh oil. I'm reading from the Old King James this morning because the Old King James uses the phrase, shall be. Most modern translations use the phrase, I have been. The Amplified translates it, I am. You say, well, which one is right? Well, I believe they are all correct. I am anointed this day with fresh oil. I have been anointed. But I, I like the rendering of the King James for somebody who's here this morning because you need to know that there's some shall be's left in your life. God still has some things that he's holding in reserve for you. And so the psalmist said, I shall be anointed with fresh oil. But I want you to look with me just underneath where it says Psalm 92. The technical beginning of this psalm is just before that, and it says a psalm, period, a song for the Sabbath day. A song, a song that is written purposefully to be sung on the Sabbath day. Well, what's, what's special about the Sabbath day? The Sabbath day is a day of rest in between two eras of time. The Sabbath day was the day that marked the end of one week. And it was a day that marked a prelude to the beginning of the coming week. Sabbath day represents a break, if you will. A break from one time period, a break that introduces the next time period. And it is on this day that the psalmist wrote this psalm to be sung, which includes the promise, I shall be anointed with fresh oil. We're, we're in a time of transition. And the thing about transition is it's uncomfortable. Has anybody else found that to be so? It's uncomfortable. It's, it, it makes us ill at ease at times. But what I felt impressed to focus on this morning is that God says by the Holy Spirit through the psalmist, in this transitional moment in my life, when I am coming out of an era and going into a new era, I shall be anointed with some fresh oil. One of the things about glory, remember, where is it? 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 18 says that we go from glory to glory. God's progressive. He's leading us from one level to the next level. He graduates us. The psalmist said, before God brings you in to this new era, he's got a new appointment for you. But before he brings you into this new level, he's going to give you some fresh oil. He's going to anoint your life with Holy Spirit power so that you'll be prepared when you don't eat, feel like it, when it doesn't seem like it. There's a reservoir of of strength you have inside you. Somebody ought to help me praise the Lord right there. Would you just praise God?